All right, so me and Matt are gonna go see uh, Eternals for the first time tonight. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm excited. I know the critics, it's got like a 48%, which is pretty bad for a Marvel film, but I'm excited for it still. Like, I know, you know, Critics are critics, man. You know, it, it, sometimes you disagree with them. Sometimes you don't. We'll see what happens. Um, I hear a lot about pacing issues, which I actually had a big problem with in Black Widow, so I'm not too surprised about that. We've also been very spoiled with the Disney Plus shows, and those are like six hours long, as opposed to an hour and a half, or I'm sorry, two to two and a half. Marvel movies are never, never an hour and a half, but you guys get what I mean. Ready to go see Eternals? Yeah, we are. We got these on again. Us trying to be disappointed a third time. And then, we, and, then the, and then the editor later, Tyler, flip. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> roll. Good old days. I know, that's end game. Uh, I might as well put a lot of light eyes in there. Oh, man. Are you ready? My pants are falling down with them. I have so much excitement. Yeah. This is what a drink looks like. <laughs> Hello, brethren. We are here, too. I'm going to just go, just in case. What did you think of... We just got out of Eternals at the movie theater very busy in there tonight that's pretty we usually don't we usually don't go on fridays we usually go on thursdays so it's definitely very busy initial impressions it was uh, what i thought would happen happened i think it's better than black widow but i like shang shang chi a lot more than this but it was good some parts really really were too, went on way too long there is a lot of talking and I, that was kind of getting on my nerves. But the parts that were good, I think were really good. I liked, I think I liked all of the characters. They did something I didn't like with one of them, but I still thought the story arc was good. So, yeah, it's good. But uh, it's not like top 10 for me or anything, but it, I liked it. But, yeah. It was exactly what I thought it was going to be. Um, when, 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 I, when I read reviews and, and I'm hearing about pacing issues, I thought it was going to be too fast. And it is at the beginning. It ha it goes back and forth. The beginning is too fast. The middle is too slow. And then the end is a pretty decent pace. I actually thought the ending was, was good in terms of pacing. Um, it's not as bad as critics are saying it is. But it, 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 is, it, is, it is a very, like, okay movie. It's not something that uh, I'll probably be starving to rewatch. Like, a, you know, an Endgame or a Shang-Chi or... Uh, even like a Disney Plus show, but it it has its purpose, I think, in the future of the MCU. That being said, as of now, it's just okay. Like, it, it was what it was. Um, I, I liked it enough to, like, say that it's a positive. But when it was good, it was great. Like, it was really good. Like, yeah, that's the problem because uh, it's so uneven, like they were saying, like everyone was saying, like, it's... It, there's not even like a complete structure to the movie. It's kind of just like a whole bunch of different things happening back to back. Someone said it was like it was like they watched a book, and I 100% see what they mean. This does not like flow like a movie. This is this is just a whole bunch of things happening after the other, and some of the stuff is really good, and some of it is like <sighs> I wanted to leave the theater. It was so boring. So yeah, it's like yeah. it's one of those movies. <laughs> yeah, I agree. What did this place used to be? Hollywood. <laughs> Hollywood. Hollywood Connection. This place used to be like the place where you'd go in Utah. They had mini golf, bowl. Did they had bowling? I think. I can't remember. I, I know feel like they, they, they did. They, they had mini arcade. golf, arcade. Uh, movie theater was right there. That that's part of the office now. They had um, rides. They had everything yeah, you they could had ever want. Roller, they had like a dragon roller coaster. They had this one where it's like a pink bus and like it goes up and down and makes your insides all tickly. And they had these air balloon ones that you could like spin the thingy. And you know what they did? Uh, they took the fun place and they turned it into a call center. It's, I know. It's, how I don't, is that? That's crazy. That's, that's where we work. <laughs> We're going to work there and then boycott it like Roblox Mobile. <laughs> yeah. I am back home. And uh, unfortunately for all of you guys, um, you're probably only going to be getting a solo Tyler vlog for the rest. Oh. I know it's boring, but it's the way it is. So deal with it. Anyways, I got groceries. 
I got groceries. Let's take a look at Tyler's grocery haul. We got some milk, milk. Got some eggs. The blue ones are mine. The mine. They're mine. We got some Pepsi. They're down there. Okay. We got some cheese. We got some hot dogs. I basically got shit that's bad for you. That's just how I am. We got some cereal. Uh, we got some. We got some tortilla chips. Let's take a look in here. Let's take a look. I don't want to show you any more of my groceries. I actually I bought salad too, but it's in the uh, it's in the salad drawer. Okay, that's enough of a grocery haul. You guys are gonna call me fat. I know I'm fat. You don't need to tell me. Just saying.